A knock on the door from a social worker is a welcome sound for this unemployed single mother of five, especially if she's bearing a very welcome, if small, amount of cash. I use it to pay electricity because I don't have water or gas. I cook on an electric stove. I also buy food for the children. For the first time in her life, 39-year-old Mariana is receiving social assistance, thanks to the social worker who sought her out and helped her apply for benefits. Finding and aiding Moldova's neediest is a result of social safety net reforms, undertaken with World Bank support. Social worker Valentina has 262 families in her case file, many of whom would not survive the recent financial crisis without the cash. This money helps them to stay alive, to exist. Reforming the system means giving based on need and people's net worth. It wasn't popular with everyone. The reform was not easy. It was quite sensitive, but the aim was to help the poorest. And there are plenty of poor. Judging by these applications for assistance, that will be entered into a database where benefits are calculated and accurate records kept reducing fraud and overpayment. The Robus have 11 children. The oldest has cerebral palsy. Their social worker checks to see how they spend their assistance. It all goes for food. It's like a man rowing a boat. He is moving, but if somebody gives the boat a push, he goes faster. Thousands of the poorest across Moldova are applying for and obtaining help thanks to social assistance reform. And as money reaches them, thousands of families are feeling a little tailwind pushing them along.